The first time I save a drawing that's been started from a template, I'm going to have to rename the drawing down here in the file name, and it automatically wants to save it as a .dwg file, which is the format for an AutoCAD drawing. Um, when the Save As dialog box opens, it chooses my documents as the default location for saving your AutoCAD drawings. I suggest that you create a folder for yourself to save your AutoCAD drawings. If I go to Create New Folder in my Documents, um, I can create a new folder and I'm going to name this for my AutoCAD drawing files. And I'm going to save this as, uh, as my first drawing as my file name. So I'll open up my folder and save. Now if I open my file manager in Windows and I go to my documents, I can see that I have a folder for my AutoCAD drawing files and if I open that I have my drawing file and it has the file extension of DWG. Now that I've saved my drawing I can see in the title bar that the name of the drawing shows up. And if I want to save again I can use the quick save on my quick access toolbar and just click that with my mouse and it saves my drawing back into that same folder. Now AutoCAD tries to protect me from losing my AutoCAD drawings because it keeps a backup each time I save. So if we go back to the Windows File Manager we'll see another file that has a file extension of BAK. So looking back again in my Windows File Manager, I can see in the folder I now have two drawing files. I have my DWG file and I have another file that has a file extension of BAK or a backup file. So this one is my currently saved drawing. This was my previously saved drawing. What it does is it renames it with a different file extension and keeps it. So now, if I have an error or a corrupted file in my current drawing file, I can go back and rename my backup file to a, back to a DWG file, and then I can open it, and I will only have lost the work that I've done between saving. If I wanted to save my drawing again, but save it under a different name, I would have to use the Save As command. When you click Save As, it opens our Save As dialog box that we saw before. Now this time I'm going to suggest that you add your AutoCAD drawing folder to the AutoCAD Places. This menu over here on the left is your Places menu. If you go inside this menu and right click, you can add the current folder. I can see I'm in my AutoCAD drawing folder right now. So I'm going to add my current folder and it's been added to this list. Now if I wanted to save this drawing uh, under a different name, then I could just rename it and save. 